one of the things that people might come and tell as devil's advocate is like, great, this whole account-based marketing thing and better conversion rates, better ICP fit, better shorter sales time, um, 2X the ACV, love it, clap, clap, clap. But how the hell do you get it to do? Like you're more on the revenue sales side, you have a counterpart, a little bit funny coffee drinker, a marketer that I personally like a lot. Um, tell me, like, how do you guys align this? I mean, do you still come to him every week and say, yo, dude, how many leads? And does he come to you and says, yo, dude, how, why is your win rate so low? <laughs> do, do you still go back to the old things when the board comes to measure? Or are you moving towards a single view and like attribution is secondary? So, you know, we, I don't want to paint too romantic of a picture. A, I think Amit is, an, Amit Bivas, shout out to Amit, is a, is a huge, yeah, yeah. a wonderful marketer and a wonderful marketing leader. I think that there's, there's a natural and healthy tension between sales and marketing. I don't think that it's a problem. I think that it's okay for me to say, you're bringing me bad leads to say it nicely and for him to say, you guys wouldn't know how to close business if it, if it smacks you on the face. But I think that, you know, what we've moved towards is, is when you define um, ABM properly, then we all know what accounts we want to bring in. And it's very, very easy now to have the conversation of like, how many of these ABM accounts have you helped, helped bring in? I think, by the way, it's also sales in an enterprise SaaS organization is not a factory. You know, and that's the biggest mistake that I made. I thought it was like, oh, marketing's going to generate the leads. SDRs are going to convert them to opportunities and then salespeople are going to take them forward. That doesn't work that way, at least not in our organization. Every organization is going to be a little bit different. But I think that for us, being able to define the, the target market, to be able to say, like, these are the companies that we want to work with. And, and you know, uh, my colleague in London and Amit and Israel, like, we're all on the same page. We know what companies we want to get. And it's much easier for us now to say, like, have we managed to convert them? And I think that, you know, companies like ours and, and, and deals like ours, we have to move away. There's no one source which is doing attribution. It sucks to measure it. It's really hard and we haven't, we haven't cracked it. I don't know how to measure the contribution of, of, of each person, but I think that as a revenue organization, you know, we are able to say, look, we, this quarter we took 30 accounts, which are ICP and managed to progress them or not. But I think it's still difficult to boil it down and say like marketing contributed 50%, partnerships contributed 30%, et cetera. 